Hello and welcome back to the channel. Wasn't going to do this, but uh, I got a few today, so I'm going to do some unboxings. I don't know what half of them are, so I'll have a quick look and see in this box. This box I thought was the biggest, so we'll have a scan to see what's in here. Um, let's check it out now. I was not when I opened a book, so talk about what's in it. But as I don't know what's in this one, I can't talk about it. But it is a bloody big box, it doesn't weigh anything. I mean, this might be a box of cricket, so it might be just wasting film. If I was in the 60s. Uh, yeah, I might just be wasting my time and effort. But whatever it is, it's packed really well. As you see, all this stuff, all of it is really annoying. Well, it's Mantis. And, ah, no, this is off. This is off somebody that I don't know if I'm mentioning, so I'm not going to mention their name. Uh, and this looks like a uh, Chapito Mantis Tenera. It's very, very tiny. Pop that lid on, and there should be ten of these in here. I do remember ordering them. I just didn't know which box was which. So let's have a look. Be very gentle in getting these out. I'll show you these in a minute. Close up. I need a macro lens for these because they really are tiny. I think they're i3. I'm gonna have to ask him. They all seem okay. That's three. Okay. It should be okay in here. Four. There's the one. Five. Oh, hang on a minute. There's, there's more than six. I think I ordered ten. <laughs> there's definitely more than ten in here. Seven. Eight. Well, there might not be. Oh no, there is. Yeah. Nine. Ten. I tell you this is off, but I'd have to kill you. Wow, he's, he's put a fair few in here. I don't know if this comes like I do this. This, this is a breeder that I bought these off. Um, so obviously I'm not going to be telling you who it is. Because that probably wouldn't be fair on the person. This one molted. And it appears to have molted on the bottom. I'm going to have to... Yes, it has. So that means the pot's gone upside down. It's actually, luckily, molted on the top. That's pretty good look. I hope there's nothing else in there that I'm going to... There's paper in here. Heavy. Hopefully this is money. No, it's not. It's a heat, it's a heat pad. Which is pretty cool. So he's, he's put an ink pad in an envelope. It's a really good way of doing it because that will keep the uh, the box nice and warm. These guys are from the Pacific, so it's probably a good idea to have an ink pad because I don't know what it's like where you live, but it's 10 degrees centigrade here at the moment, which is bloody cold. Which means it got. Fairly low last night. I don't know what it was. I was asleep conveniently. But I should imagine it got a bit nippy. I didn't count them up to 10. But yeah, you put a fair few in here. There's 15 in here. I ordered 10 and he's put 15 in. So I haven't paid for them yet. It's probably going to want a lot of pennies for this. We'll have to see. Wow, they are. Small, but cute. I'm gonna get my macro lens out. Wow, these guys are so hard to film. He likes to spend a lot of time jumping on, well, oh, he's gone. A lot of time jumping on the actual camera. Don't think I'm gonna get, that's not too bad focus. If I go any closer, let's see if I can zoom in. If I go any closer, he will jump on the camera. He's got a lovely, like a yellow, see if I can get a 
focus. A little yellow stripe right down his back. Look at that. Yellow streak down his back. Must be a coward. But it is a truly beautiful mantis. They are quite small though. I don't know the common name. Uh, I've heard them called the Australian net mantis before. And they're actually from a few places in the Pacific. Look at the antenna go. But that is super cute. Now, they're going to make awesome pets, if not breeders for me, because they're going to be a pain in the neck for me. But that's it. That's a little cute guy. Any cute? Try and get a focus there and there, which we can't for some reason. Very quiet this one, right? Keep jumping on the camera. Sorry about this focus business, but it's pretty small. Look at him. That is super cute. I better go and tell him they all arrive safely. Well, that's it. Uh, Torpedo Mantis Tenera, which is uh, a really cute Pacific Mantis. Hopefully I'm going to be breeding these in the future. I shall imagine I'm not going to kill 15 of them. Um, and they will be available in the distant future, I should imagine. Um, we'll have to see how it goes with these because they are small. I've never had them before. And I hope they're not like my glass mantis, which are, I don't know, they're a bit dodgy glass mantis to, to breed. So I'm not bothered. That's Crystal. I've just got one and she's a pet. And that's how I like to keep the glass mantis as pets. So these will be available in the future. And, and hopefully people will buy them. We'll see. Okay. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.